Hi, welcome to the tutorial on how to burn an audio CD from Songbird. As most people know, if they're at this video, that you can't do that within Songbird as of yet. So we're going to do a workaround. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to first go into Sound and Audio and open up Songbird. And once we're in Songbird, we're going to need an add-on. And uh, we're going to find the add-ons under Bookmarks, Songbird Add-ons. Opens another window. I'm going to go to Search, and we're going to just type in Export. And the first thing that should come up is Playlist Export Tool. All you have to do is hit Install, allow the thing to install, and then Restart Songbird to use it but I've already installed it so all I need to do is go to file uh, export playlist and you can see that it's given me a duplicate of the playlist that's on the side I'm gonna choose something really simple I know that uh, this playlist only has a couple of songs in it so that's fine uh, after I've chosen this I want to just double check my preferences so I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna make sure that it's it in its own folder and I have put it on the desktop you can put it anywhere you want I also want to make sure that the format that it's going to export to is going to be a PLS file not the M3U file so we're going to make sure that we choose that go OK so all I need now is just to export it you can see that once it's done it says so in the little sidebar I'm going to close this out now and I'm going to close out Songbird because we don't need that. Okay, so we need to use another program to actually burn this playlist. And the program that I'm going to use is called Banshee. And that program is available through your Add Remove, um, so you can install it quite easily. But I've already installed it, so we're going to go to the Banshee Media Player. And here it is, Banshee. Now, all I need to do now is media, import, whoops, import playlist, and I made a playlist on my desktop called playlist, and there's that one Lisa J's iPod playlist, that's just fine. The minute I've imported it, it comes in my music library on the side, so I'm going to click on that, and you can see there's only two songs in here, so I'm going to click on one. Um, you're going to want to choose all your songs that you want to put on. If there's more songs that will fit on a CD, you're going to have to break it up into several CDs. Um, because I've only got two songs, I can select them all. I can do that with Control A on my keyboard or go up to Edit and go Select All in here. Once I've selected all the music that I'm going to be putting on a audio CD, then I just go back into Edit and I go Write CD. You can see that it brings up my playlist and the selected songs, and I just hit Burn. I already have a CD in my player. If you don't, it will ask for one at this point. But now all I need to do is hit Burn and I'm finished. So that's it. If you want to burn an audio disc from your playlist in Songbird, this is a workaround that lets you do that. Okay, thank you very much, and you have a nice day.